Hey guys, Coach Pillow is here. So tight punches are dangerous, right? But despite the negative stigma around wide punches, wide punches are dangerous in their own way. And that is because they come from your peripherals, outside of your line of sight. Whenever you're fighting somebody, oftentimes wherever your head goes, their eyes will follow, right? So if I throw a wide punch, I'm ultimately separating their center of focus, which is my head, all right, away from my punching hand, right? And ultimately, they just get caught with something that they don't see coming. A perfect example is Gary Coley versus Jose Felix Jr. Now watch Gary Coley's eyes as it's locked in on the head of Felix Jr.'s head. So when Felix throws that overhand, Coley just did not see it coming. Now here are some other examples. You got Michael Plania versus Joshua Grier. Luis Alberto Lopez versus Gabriel Flores Jr. And this is a good one. You got Oscar Valdez versus Miguel Berchelt. And lastly, you got Mauricio Lara versus Lee Wood. And it's not just wide shots to the head that are dangerous, it's also wide shots to the body. Like you got Luke Campbell against Ryan Garcia, Julio Cesar Martinez versus Jay Harris. Now, I'm not saying that wide punches are better. Tight punches have their benefits and wide punches have theirs. It all depends on the fighter and the situation. Also, there's a difference between a wide hook and swinging wildly, all right? You don't want to be swinging wildly because that's just plain ineffective and it's going to get you knocked out, all right? You don't want to get sloppy. If you're on the receiving end of wide punches, the best way to see them coming is not to focus in on their head, but look towards their chest and their shoulders area. This way it activates better peripherals so that you're able to see everything like the movement of their shoulders when they throw those white punches but all right everybody thank you guys for tuning into that video if you guys have any questions please comment down below please like comment and subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys on the next one